Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clan. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the DG58 LSW and Mono Warfare 3. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also like the video. Let's try to get this video to 55 likes. I'd highly appreciate it and it helps out the channel a bunch. Over on the secondary, we're going to be going with the Renetti. Tactical is the Stem. Lethal is Simtex. Field Upgrade, Trophy System. Gloves, Scavenger Gloves. Boots is the Covert Sneakers and gear is eod padding over on the vest we're going to be going with the demolition vest this gives you resupply and two lethals so jumping into the optic this is a personal preference attachment you can go with the iron sights or you can go with any other optic that you choose but for this class setup i am going to be using the slate reflector over on the stock we're going to be going with a recoil reduction butt plate this gives you gun kick control and recoil control and over on the ammunition to give it that max damage i guess feel we're going to be going with the high grain rounds this gives you bullet velocity and damage range you do lose out on quite a bit of recoil control and to also help out with more of the quote-unquote max damage we're going to be going with the woody long barrel for aiming out of sway bullet velocity and range recoil control and gun kick control this one actually gives you or this is the only one that gives you bullet velocity and damage range and it boosts it up pretty like good if you look over at the stats and over on the muzzle we're going to be going with the t51r billeted break this gives you vertical recoil control firing aim stability and gun kick control you do lose out on quite a bit of horizontal recoil so you got to keep that in mind and you lose a little bit of like of uh bullet velocity and range but you can't really tell too much it's only like five percent and four percent as you can see that's going to do it for this class setup. I highly recommend trying it out. And if you do, let me know your thoughts down in the comments. I have a crazy gameplay for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that. And if you do, let me know the like. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. A small percentage of people that watch my videos are subscribed. So if you like this video, consider subscribing. And also follow me on Twitch where I stream and play with followers. Also, if you'd like to, you can follow me on Twitter where you can stay up to date with me. And I also have a Discord. So if you'd like to, we can connect more on there. Now let's get back to the video. Right, we're going to be checking out the DG58 LSW today. This is a little bit crazy of a map to be using this gun, but... We're going to do our best to show off the class setup that we have today. in a bad situation right here. That was a very bad spot. Try to get a nuke for you guys. I think this would be an insane map. Good. I need more ammo. to get more ammo right there. Oh my god, why are you in there? Oh my god. I forgot that I had trophies on, so it kind of messed me up. Might as well just stick with it now. It's not bad to have trophies on shipment either. Oh my 
my god. Nineteen right there. I got it. These guys love sitting in this little crate right here. Spawning on my left. There's the MGB right there. And just in time, too, because I was going to get shotgun. That's actually insane. I'm playing with a brand new controller, too, by the way. It's a default regular controller. And I am not used to it. I feel so stiff. He just spawned right on top of me. Everybody's using shotguns. <laughs> I get a hundred, then I'm gonna end it. Good gameplay though. I was playing pretty slow. Got the nuke for you guys, and now I'm just gonna shred the whole lobby.
I'm gonna keep it going just to see how how long this game can last. Alright, let's go ahead and call this nuke in. I mean, the video is kind of dragging out now. I did not expect to get an MGB though. Gonna be honest. Hundred sixteen though, GG's.